Welcome everyone to the, well, the, as you can see, Iceberg C. And we are in here in race number three, home of whale, right now. Let's, let's take a look at our total standings right here. Glare is in the lead with that 48 points, the leading over shark, then whales in third. Speaking of, volcano going forth, then bread. Then it's Rainforest to run out the top six so far as we see all of these marbles ready to compete. I am Sam Lopeka and we're about to get rolling on this 12 lap. Instead of 13 laps, we got 12 laps in a shootout for the win. Who will be able to do it here in this marble dome as we get started with the race number three of this marble final tournament? Away we go! And it looks like it's a good start. All the marbles in that first final. Whale gets out to an early lead. The Volcano with a nice sprint. Ooh, almost collided with Shark there. But he, Volcano does manage to get the fastest lap out of the rest. There goes all the other marbles following through. Oh, we have stuck Stuckage stuck right there as Bread comes on through. I think that was Ivory who got stuck there. Looks like it. It is. <laughs> oh, we have, then we have a marble that fell off. It was Pickle. It's not, not good. That's not good for Pickle. As he, as he just falls off. I think he'll be in last at, at the starting grade for lap number two. And there you can see Ivory stuck. It's right before the finish line. We can see right there. That's not where you want to get stuck at. Especially in between those two hexagons. You can't even fall out of that stuck. It's not good. But what we saw there. Now it's lap number two as they all get once again, inside the funnel. Glare needs some help getting inside, and there they all go. Can Flame take the early lead? No, it's going to be Dripper. And now it's Volcano. Dripper falls off the course. That is not good for Dripper. And Shark just, just, took, just took the win there. Glare is coming through. Oh, and Bread fell, fell off the course, too. That's not good for those marbles. Oh, good spread to the finish line. Rainforest, think, with the, with the collision there. As... You can see right here, Dripper fell off right there. I can't believe Dripper actually did manage to fall off. It was talking just about how Dripper did it. There's, there's where Bread fell off at just moments before the finish line. As you can see, that end of that slope right there is the finish line. It's close, but it's not good enough for Bread. But that was only the second lap. We still have 10 more laps to go. And as we get into the next lap, all of the marbles are in the funnel now. Who's got the lead early? That's Monkey, it looks like. Will he be able to keep it? Monkey getting through. And yes, he will. There's Penguin. And there goes all the other marbles following through. These, these marbles are really having great race battles. Rainforest finishing. Now Flame making sure to get up there. And Invasion, you know he needs to have some points haul because he only has zero points by entering this race. And then Bread fell off again. Can't believe it. Bread Bisbee fell off once again on the course. We we got word that Bread is not doing well after the collision happened in last race. That's why he was starting in the grid in last. As we hinge now lap number four. All the marbles are getting inside. Rainforest with the lead. No, Shark with the nice sprint to the finish line. Shark just take it right back. There's Bread and there's, there's all the marbles. Volcano finishing. And every single marble getting down there, trying to sprint to the finish line. There comes Invasion once again, not in last this time. Here comes Flame, and I think Flame, depend depending on any DNFs, nope, there is none. So Flame will finish in last, and he'll start in last as we get into race number three's lap five. This is the fifth lap out of 12 as Whale holds the lead. No, Billboard comes out of nowhere for that win. In that lap, Whale comes in second place. All the others getting through. I think I was Brad that was being great. Oh, the impact collision by Invasion as he spinned it to the finish line. There's Volcano, there's Shark, and here comes Rainforest. So that finishes out lap number five. An amazing job for what Whale did. Fans are just going crazy already after lap number five as we hint ourselves for the next lap. All of these marbles. Really fighting for whoever can lead the standings. Volcano is just out of this world, getting his own fastest lap, and now he takes it with one, well, that, you know, that, that much amount of points haul. Amazing job 
by Volcano what he did there. There goes all of the other marbles finishing the course. Just look at this. Oh, but we have a stuckages there. Whale, t whale took took one t right, right, like halfway through to to the um, you know to start there. And molecule, molecule, just like not not doing necessarily good in his mobile mobile race right now. Whale is in second. Well, I think that's third place in the standings right now. As all of these marbles get on through, we are now in lap number seven. These laps are going by very fast. Then a shark that takes the lead, and oh, just got stumbled up. Tries to beat Volcano's time, doesn't, but still, I'm getting all these marbles straight through. And whoa, Tripper, as you can see, the the tops, the the top section of your screen fell off the course. Tripper, not doing well with the fall offs. That is not what you want to do. Rainforest comes in. And there's Carrot Sprint. And there's where Dripper fell all the way on the left side of your, or not the left side, but the top side of your screen. That's that that was that was not good for what Dripper could have could have done like better. You got it done literally better as we begin lap number eight. And what's this? A jam clog we have. So with that, we're gonna have to redo lap number eight. Can't believe we actually just saw. A jam clock in marble racing history. That, that, that's rarely being seen as we, we do lap 8. And Shark obliterates the fastest lap with 962. So we're going to get an extra point for that. Nice job by Shark. The bonus point for the fastest lap all up on the dot here. There's the last three marbles. Invasion getting the best out of the rest. Then there, Ivory almost getting stuck there. But did not as we get into lap number nine. As we complete everybody else's race point out in the action. Flame. Down flame down flame goes. Can he be able to complete an invasion with the nice sprint? And I think that was Monkey Day past Flame also in lap number nine. All these marbles. They're just ready to race in action volcano. Almost passing. Oh, <laughs> that was gonna be close right there for for this lap and what is this another sprint marble billboard fell off though earlier in the course we didn't see it but billboard we got word that he fell off and he's not able to race like that much and dripper again i think that's probably the third time dripper has fallen off this course right now that is not very good for dripper dripper needs to step up his game if he wants to take the lead on any of the top spots here as we get into lap number 10 all of these marbles their deficit is trying to ma maneuver ivory taking the lead can he take the action all the marbles get on through there's bread oh it's tight one between rainforest and glare but i think that one's gonna go to rainforest all those marbles. Oh, Carrot! He bumped Dripper into the finish line and he just got stuck right there. As you can see, to near the end of that finish line, that is not a good way to get stuck there. Carrot bumps Dripper. Dripper crosses the finish line. No problem, but Carrot getting stuck right there. Really not going to help him as we get into our second to last lap. As all of these marbles are ready to rumble. These marbles trying to take advantage of it. Whale doing it at his home floor for first place. There goes all the other marbles. And there they go. Ivory. No invasion beat <laughs> Ivory and Volcano there. There goes Dripper. Dripper trying to finish the course after having a lot of fall offs. There goes Penguin sprinting now. And that's after lap 11. And this time Shark fell off. What is going on with these marbles? Now this time Shark fell off. We have we had a lot of marbles that fell off throughout the course of these laps. That is not good. You need to try not to fall off, you know? All the marbles stopped actually right before going into the final lap. Who is going to be the winner of race number three? It will probably be the home team whale. Yes, it will be the home marble whale. We'll win it, Monkey. Coming second. There's Brett in third. And there goes all the mobiles. Oh, impact collision there. Here comes Invasion. Then it's Pickle. Then Billboard. Any more mobiles? Yes, it is. Yes, there is. 
Ivory coming up, and there goes Penguin sprinting to the finish line. So what a nice job there by Whale. Wonder how this all is going to be done to the standings here right now. Here in this podium, you can see Whale on top, Monkey, Silver, and Bred's in third. Bred's in that bronze spot. You can see the standings right after race number three. All of these marbles are just... We did, we did have the shark fastest lap, just by the way. So uh, there's so supposed to be any one more bonus point added. But don't worry about the standings. Right now, we see our total standings as Clear and Whale are tied for first place with 55. Shark still in third. Then you got Brand Monkey, Molecule Rainforest, and Dripper running out the top half as Volcano starts all the way down to Invasion. Well, we will see you when we go to Snowy Mountain next.